Hello. All right, so I'm going to teach you what I just figured out on my own. Um, so I had a texture for the eyeball that I wanted to control with geometry nodes. Uh, let's see, iris, dilate, iris dilation is a ex good example. All right, this is inside geometry nodes. Um, the, the eyeball itself is an object. The iris is an object. Uh, I have the left iris and the right iris use different, uh, it's, it's the exact same um, uh, material. The only difference is I can control the variables for each copy independently. And by what I mean by that is the color, uh, like I can control the dilation independently, or I can control them together. Uh, I can control the hue, which is basically the color. I can control the, the saturation. Um, brightness level of each eye is independent and none of these except for dilation uh, none of these are plugged into anything within the geometry nodes uh, they're, they're not plugged in uh, what I did is I used these to drive the shader alright to do this You can go to which first you have to uh, go to the geometry nodes, go all the way to the top layer, and create a variable. Let's name this uh, test. All right. You right click on test, not here. If you right click on here, you'll get the uh, the input value, which is like input number 17 and the next one will be input number 18 so don't right click here you go over here right click copy as new driver then you go over to the the shading tab and let's go ahead and delete that driver and paste driver alright that is some creepy eyes. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, let's see. Where did I go back to? All right. So now I have this controls the brightness. That's it. That's all it is to it. You just right click on it, copy as new driver, go to the shading tab paste the driver in here. Oh, and the reason that these show up is because of I added in the hue saturation value node, shift A, hue saturation node. That's it. And then I just control these with the drivers. And you can do that with anything here. Uh, control it with drivers. The reason I did that is because I want everything to be controlled from the geo nodes inputs um, that's it it really is just that simple and you can look into my eyes the black depths of the void Creepiness. <laughs> that, for whatever reason, that just looks like a smile, like a creepy smiley face. But yeah, that's uh, working on my 
this is all made through geometry nodes. I'm not going to show the rest. I want to keep it as a surprise.